In light of yesterday's shooting inside a Michigan courthouse, today News 3's Jenna Madaw met with the Dane County Sheriff and head bailiff to discuss how they make sure everyone inside the Dane County Courthouse is kept safe. After the shooting at the courthouse in Michigan, officials here at the Dane County Courthouse are looking to learn from the tragedy. This incident in the courthouse in Michigan further highlights what dangers our law enforcement officers face every single day. Danger that was seen before in the old city county building. At times uh, in that building prior to moving in 1994 had uh, incidents where weapons including firearms were brought into the building and caused significant threats and at times uh, fatal injuries as a result of active shooter incidents. But since then, the Dane County Courthouse has put new procedures into place. We have weapon screening. We have uh, a number of sworn uh, deputy sheriffs working within the courthouse itself, uh, assigned to each one of our courts. And officials make an effort to ensure all people working inside the courthouse know the procedures. We not only train our law enforcement folks, but we also train our civilian staff as well in case we have an incident like this that would occur in our courthouse. We will actually run them through courtroom scenarios, um, put them in different places, uh, give them different things to think about uh, to try to prepare them because it is a very stressful situation that occurs very quickly. And when it comes to transferring inmates? It's our policy that, that people will be handcuffed who are coming from the jail or coming to court. Now, officials here at the Dane County Courthouse haven't made any policy changes yet, but they say once they get all the information from the Michigan shooting, then they'll take a second look at their own policies and practices. In Madison, Jenna Middaw, WISC News 3. And Sheriff Mahoney says the most important factor in keeping everyone safe is ensuring the courthouse has training, technology, and equipment to do the job.